your gold medalist from Belgium, Luna Hendricks. And with the silver medal from South Korea, Yeilim Kim. With the bronze from Japan, Rion Sumiyoshi. Luna Hendricks of Belgium continues her mining exploration from last season, picks up her second Grand Prix medal for the second time on her birthday, but this time it's gold. Taking a page from the ice dancers this season, she starts with a commanding skate to her J Baldwin short program, which gives her a 72 and change to put her in to the lead. Super, super duper spicy, we love it. Free program, different from what she started her preseason with, going with a fallen angel theme. Well, if this is her fall from grace, Miss Luna, you best keep on falling. She looked spicy and red Yet another clean skate in the free program, receiving all positive GOEs from top to bottom. Almost hitting her PB in the free program and the total score here. Perfect place you want to be heading into the rest of the Grand Prix season. Commanding her gold medal win by 20 points. And she will be looking at repeating this result, I'm sure, at her Grand Prix in Finland. After a flawless free program, sitting in the kiss and cry, getting scores she's elated about, Maie Berenice Mete of France brings her out a little cake to celebrate her 23rd birthday. Also, big shout out to Maie of France after coming back from a devastating injury at last year's World where she tore her Achilles tendon. This was her first event back and she looked great. Yelim Kim of South Korea picks up her first Grand Prix medal with a silver. The refined and elegant skater from South Korea headed into the free program in second place after a masterful short program. Opens up her free program with an unexpected mistake on the triple LUT, just sliding off of her landing edge there, a jump that she usually garners huge points in GOEs for. She fights back and seems to be back on track until her final jumping pass, the triple sow. She goes down yet again. Uh, the imperfect program puts her in fourth in the free program and allows her to barely hold on to that silver medal by less than half a point from the young Japanese skater, Rian Sumiyoshi. Other than being eighth at the Junior World Championships last year, Rian was virtually unknown. This is her first year on the Senior Grand Prix circuit. Sitting in fifth after the short program, she made a huge mistake on her final triple LUTs that just doesn't get into the air and into the rotation. She will have to fight back in the free program and fight back she did. Opens up the free with a huge quad toe, falls hard on it, left side just a little bit open, almost over rotated. But this is the first quad we've seen attempted on the Grand Prix circuit in the women's event. So big points for her here. Little mistakes throughout kept chipping away at her score, but such amazing promise in this young 19 year old. For example, that exit of her triple LUTs, uh, such beautiful highlights technically and choreographically in this free program choreographed by Shaylin Bourne. She has everything going for her, a quad, uh, that is seems ready to go uh, skating skills that many in this event would die for a little bit more presentation but she's ripe for the picking and ripe to be at the top of the senior ranks I cannot wait to see more of her I know you love that video so subscribe so you don't miss any more and you're sitting here anyways watch some more <laughs>